Park Swap. We're at SeaWorld San Diego again to check out on the park and do some updates. Look at this massive wall that they put up right in front of the Submarine Quest attraction. And I don't know if you can notice, uh, but the tracks are now gone for the Submarine Quest ride. They're effectively totally taking it down and uh, just leaving the Ocean Explorer area as the other attractions for now. So I wonder if that means something new is coming here or if they just thought it was about time to get rid of it. I've seen what the ride has become and uh, let's just say it was totally in disrepair. So it makes sense that they're removing it now, but it's just crazy. There's a great video that just came out by Defunct Land on this crazy weird dark ride. Well, I guess it's kind of not really a dark ride, a light ride. I should say, uh, what a weird attraction and what a good video that Defunct Land made on it. So definitely check that out. Over at Journey to Atlantis, it looks like they have a kind of crane lift thing over there. So they must be starting to do some work on this attraction. It's really the last major one that hasn't opened yet with the park. And I'm really expecting to see it soon, especially as it starts to get hotter in the summer. You can actually see they have water. That's why all these seagulls are flying in there. The water in the pool is filled up. I don't think that's been true for a very long time. So that's a good sign that they're gonna start testing this soon and starting to get the ride ready to open. We're also here on a mission today. We're gonna try to get the free pass holder Christmas ornament. Uh, it looks like a walrus. It looks really cute. And some people's are pretty derpy. So I'm excited to get it and show Ali, see what she thinks of it. Mission accomplished. We got the Christmas ornament. Let's check it out. Let's open it up and see how it looks. All right, here we go. Oh my God, it's like a quarter the size I thought it was. Look how tiny this thing is. Oh my God! Look at how derpy it is. Look at the teeth on them. Oh, they're crooked too. Uh, well, Allie's gonna really love this, so I'm excited. I really love it too, so cute. Oh, it's the seal! The walrus. Oh. Giving away ornaments. Yeah. What's his name? Strudel. <laughs> I was watching Chopped. I love it. It's kind of funny because it's like the 2020 Christmas ornament item and they just brought it back. It's such a random time to do it, but you know, I, I love it. I love that they did that. It's just, it's so random. I like free stuff and uh, definitely got me to come to the park today. <laughs> Allie and I went jet skiing out here, it was super fun. Right across the way is actually a dog beach right over there. Uh, so that gets a lot of activity in the day. And uh, yeah, it was cool to, you know, ride right past SeaWorld. What a weird experience. Something I forgot to mention in my last video is the Bayside Skyride is now open as well. And that must be really cool. I think I'm gonna wait for Allie to be back for that one because that seems pretty romantic and, and really cute. You may remember this from our previous videos, but the Circus Delay Theater, like this thing used to be so cool looking. It's now entirely demolished. And over the past week, they really just got rid of the whole thing. And I really don't know why. <laughs> Honestly, no clue why. Hopefully they're gonna be putting something even better in. Otherwise, that'd be a huge letdown that they let this really cool show and really cool set go to waste. I see something we didn't see last video. It looks like Shipwreck Rapids is operational right now so I can get some footage of it. Obviously, I'm not gonna ride it myself. That seems a little bit sad. Allie and I were talking, we're like, man, that'd be so sad if I just rode it by myself and got wet and had no one to share it with. So this is something I'm gonna do when Allie's back with me. Uh, but yeah, let's take a look at the ride and see how it runs. I've never seen it. Woo! 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 Oh wow, here goes a raft. Is anyone on that? No, I think it's empty. Wow, the water really goes fast. That's crazy. And it looks like they added like a drip element right here. Man, I hear you get absolutely destroyed on this thing. Look at this dip right here. That's just stupid. That's stupid how fast that is. And then there's another dip there. Oh my God. I'm gonna be doing a video soon on the top rapids rides in Southern California. So definitely subscribe if you're excited for that. I know I am. It'll be a lot of fun to really rank what we think is the best one in all of Southern California. Cause there's a lot of good contenders here. The heaters are getting some good use today. Makes sense, it's actually very cold out right now. Here's Dolphin Point, closed for refurbishment. 
Hey, last time I was looking at the dolphin exhibit, there was no water in the tank. It looks like they finally refilled it with water. So they must be planning to open this pretty soon. That's good to know if you're going to be coming in the next few weeks. The uh, dolphin point might actually be open. Well, that was cool to see all the updates with the attractions. Hopefully that helps you if you're going to be coming to SeaWorld San Diego here in the next few weeks. It'll probably be very similar to now, except packed if it's on the weekends. Definitely always better to go at nighttime if you don't care and you have a season pass. Nighttime's a lot less busy than during the day. The day gets so packed. And also try to go on rides when everyone's at one of the shows, because that also is really helpful. That eats a lot of people up and uh, frees you up to go on all the rides with a short wait time. Well, it looks like Manta's closed, so like almost all the rides are closed. No wonder Shipwreck Rapids is still open. They're probably just trying to keep something open for people to do. Uh, but yeah, there's actually a pretty cool thing that Sammy, one of my viewers, told me. So you see these windows over here? First of all, this is where we were last video. When we were down in the queue, there's this much deeper part, and you can see that from the queue. But if you actually went towards the aquarium side, not the line queue, you would walk under here and sometimes see the mantas just, you know, going right over top of you. And that must be so cool. If the queue opens back up, I'd love to see it. Look at how majestic the mantas are. They're, they're so cool. So chill. I think they remind me of me a little bit. Oh, look, it's me and Allie. Well, I'm honestly surprised how much ground we covered today. There's actually a lot going on at SeaWorld San Diego, so we'll have to come back here every week to check out how it's going, see if some of these things are opening up again, and uh, yeah, just get an overall view of the park. I think that would be really good. Oh, sounds like the ride's going again. Something crazy is since last time I was here too, they added social distancing markers all the way out here. This ride must be getting insanely long waits, especially with Electric Eel being closed. I bet that's why they had to do that. Uh, but yeah, they just reopened the ride so everyone's rushing over there. It's exciting to be able to ride one ride, finish off the night strong. Road Manta once, that was so good, rode it in the back seat. And now I think I'm literally the last person in line and I'm actually gonna have a train all to myself. So this is weird. <laughs> yeah, look at this, there's no one in any other row. So it's just gonna be me. This is so, so weird. I think this is my first time in the first row too, but it sucks that it's gonna be an empty car. Get ready, Charlie, if you're all oh! Well, that was a crazy experience being the only one on the ride. One employee did accompany me. He was in the very back and I was in the very front. That's definitely a cool experience, and what a way to end the night at SeaWorld San Diego. Thank you for celebrating the world of the sea with me. I'll see you in the next episode of Park Swap. Bye.